Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to browse Google on your Nintendo Switch. So quickly just open up system settings, then find internet, internet settings, and here's what we're going to do. We're going to connect to a custom DNS server, which will allow us to access the internet. And once we're there, we can browse Google to our heart's content. Just tap on your Wi-Fi network, change settings, scroll down, find DNS settings. It will be automatic by default. Just tap on it, set it to manual. And primary DNS, I want you to sell it to the server you see on screen right here. Make sure you type the numbers in correctly, otherwise you may see an error saying could not perform DNS uh, name resolution. So if you get an error like that or something similar, just enter in that DNS, make sure it's entered in successfully. Then we'll tap on OK, save, OK, connect. So this is what's going to happen. It's going to connect to the network device and not to the internet because it's going to ask for authentication. Now, of course, that means if you want to actually play you know, Switch Online games, you will need to reverse this. I'll show you how to reverse this in just a minute. So we'll just tap on next here. And any moment now, you're going to be brought to the internet. So what is this? It kind of glitched out there. Usually it just puts you straight to the internet. That's very weird. I think we may need to re-register the network if that's the case. I've actually never seen that before. So we'll just give this a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete this network and I'm going to try it again. So I'm going to scroll down, TP link, and of course I have to enter in my passcode. All right, so we're connected again. Let's try this again. So hopefully you won't need to do this, but just in case you get you know an error like that, don't want to make this tutorial look perfect. Let's go chain settings, DNS settings, manual. There we go. Let's try this again now. So okay connect and hopefully this time we're going to be brought on google without any issues so a bit annoying but it is what it is you know I'm not making this tutorial look perfect all right there you go so it actually took a really long time to connect which was really weird but you can see we are now brought to the switch brew dns you just tap on google right here and you can uh, google whichever query you want this auto feels horrible let's see what could possibly come up and yeah the google is fully working you can see this is google right this is the google search query and um yeah so let's go to the uh, youtube channel of saunders tech so this is actually my main channel by the way and you can see i mean look at this this is proper browsing google I'm now on youtube right now and um yeah everything's fully working so i don't know if you can play videos on youtube and stuff like that ah uh, doesn't let you play html5 so in order to reverse it, you just press on the X and then OK, and that will remove you out of the page. Then tap on your network, change settings, DNS settings, set it back to automatic. If that causes issues, just tap on manual, and then set the server to 1.1.1.1. And then, I'm just going to set to automatic because that works. Then save, OK, connect to this network. And uh, yeah, that should solve the issue. So you can see I'm back on the internet. If you ever want to go back onto the DNS, you just set the settings uh, manual and your DNS server should be saved, which means you can just always go back to Google at any time. So hopefully this video did help you out. If it did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye bye.